Hey, KS Services is now running their $59 fall tune-up special. Our team arrives on time and is always professional. Be sure your unit is ready for the cooler temperatures by visiting our website, callks.com today, and schedule your appointment. It's fast and easy. The weather's getting cooler and the days are getting shorter. Don't let the fall weather sneak up on you. Call us today. 205-322-9090, AL certification number 1112. This is the Weather Extreme video. It's the morning edition for Thursday, the 14th of December. I'm James Spann. Alabama's weather dry through Saturday. We think the weather will be wet before the weekend is over. And Christmas getting close. What's the weather going to do on the big day? Let's go in there and talk about it. Here's the water vapor satellite view, broad trough over the eastern U.S. From time to time, clippers come down the backside of that from Canada, reinforcing the cool air we have in place. Pretty cold this morning, mostly 30s, although Fort Payne has dropped down to 25. Birmingham at 35. Highs today should be in the 50s. There's that cold air up north around the Great Lakes in the northeast United States, eastern Canada. New surge of that will drop in here tomorrow. Highs should probably slip back into the 40s for North Alabama. Watch warning map. Got some winter weather advisories for parts of Pennsylvania, some of the adjacent states. Otherwise, things are quiet. Thunder not today. That's the uh, severe weather outlook. Pretty stable air mass around the continental United States. Here's the precipitation for the next seven days. Some of the bigger numbers are down here in the deep south, the Gulf Coast region. Rain amounts in Alabama between one and two inches between now and Thursday morning of next week. And no doubt... Uh, Rain, uh, pretty good possibility Sunday and Sunday night. Early next week, a little iffy. Let's check it out. Model fans, here's the GFS, the 06E run at noon today. Troughing over the east. And again for today, we'll call it partly sunny with a high in the mid to upper 50s, right at seasonal averages for mid-December. Tomorrow, colder. High slip back in the upper 40s, a mixture of clouds and sunshine. Saturday will be a sunny day. We start the day, I'd say, in the mid to upper 20s, another freezing morning. High Saturday in the 50s. Clouds increase Saturday night. And Sunday, rain begins to slip in here as a feature that's been over northern Mexico begins to move in from the west. Uh, most likely, the rain begins uh, midday or Sunday afternoon. And the GFS wants to keep it going. This is Monday, and this is Tuesday. So if this were to verify, we'd maintain that chance of rain through at least Monday and maybe into part of the day Tuesday. But again, the European is kind of different. Uh, Monday, relatively dry, and Tuesday, very dry. So I think what we'll do is just uh, mention rain beginning Sunday afternoon, Sunday night. We'll probably keep some chance of rain into Monday. Then we'll trend Tuesday dry out of respect to the European. And there's no really cold air involved here. Highs will be uh, maybe in the low 60s early next week, and this is Wednesday, back to the GFS. That looks dry. This is a week from today, Thursday, the 21st of December, troughing in the west, the zonal flow here, upper high, over western Cuba, and again, that's a dry air mass, a dry, chilly morning, pretty comfortable afternoon. This is the end of the forecast period. We go out there about 10 days, Sunday, December 24th, Christmas Eve, Got an upper high east of Florida, big cold trough in the western states. And obviously, there's going to be an interesting boundary setting up here. Let's check the surface chart. And uh, we're clearly in the, in the air that will just produce rain uh, if this verifies. And that's a big if. We all know this is uh, in the land of voodoo. And if this were to verify on Christmas Eve, if you want snow, you'd have it in Chicago, Milwaukee, Des Moines, Omaha, Amarillo, Texas, like Kansas City and St. Louis could see a wintry mix, but down here, rain would likely creep in here. And this is Christmas Day, Monday, December 25th. Again, for us, that would be uh, wet with highs in the 50s, if this were to verify. And we all know that's a big if. Check the numbers coming off the GFS Ensemble. And again, this kind of got us up in the, in the low 60s early next week. But generally speaking, temperatures, again, very close to where they should be based on seasonal averages for the rest of the month with highs mostly in the 50s, lows 30s and 40s. That's it for the Weather Extreme video this morning. We'll have notes in the blog next video here by 3 o'clock this afternoon. If you can't catch us this evening on ABC 3340 News at 4, 5, 6 and 10 o'clock. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and God bless.
Hey, KS Services is now running their $59 fall tune-up special. The weather's getting cooler and the days are getting shorter. Don't let the fall weather sneak up on you. Call us today, 205-322-9090, AL certification number 11120.